Stop the music. Right, ladies and gentlemen, do me a favour. Can you stop calling for a second? Stop, stop, stop calling. Uh, the reason why I've just taken the number off screen is because we have a technical fault. Uh, and we can't accept any callers at the moment. So if anyone does actually dial the number still now, you will be charged, but you will definitely not be selected. Uh, OK, so please do not... Please do not actually dial. Now, while I'm waiting for all my uh, all my tons of friends to kind of uh, to kind of figure out this this is I tell you what. Listen, come in. This is what happens now. Okay, please don't call. And um, this is what happens. Basically, uh, what I'm now hearing in my ear is incredible. Um, I'm going to let you into a secret. What happens now is that someone's going. Okay, Chris, we have a problem. You need to fill. Uh, this is live TV. There's no script. So one of the, one of the things I'd like you to do at this moment is look at your watch. Okay, look at your watch. Uh, mine says, is it about uh, six minutes to one? Is that, has that everyone got that? Six minutes to one. Okay, you now need to say how long can this guy fill for without running out of things to say, okay? And then the moment the technical problem is sorted, I'll bring on the telephone number. But while, okay, we've got that, six minutes to one. Okay, now, but while I'm waiting, I will remind you of a few things. Um, there are only two films up here on the board tonight that do not have a big star in it. I'll try and go through some of the stars of the films that we've been already been shown. We've got The Sixth Sense, okay, as you can see there. Uh, in that movie was um, Bruce Willis, okay? See, th at this point as well, I get no help. Uh, I'm literally just you. Uh, you got Seven, uh, Brad Pitt was in that, uh, and also... Um, oh. Morgan Freeman was also in it. Uh, you got 101 Dalmatians. Uh, you know that film. It was just full of dogs. Uh, and, uh, you've all <laughs> uh, and you've also got Seven Brides and Seven Brothers. Now, because that's quite an old film, I don't, I, I don't actually know who is actually in that particular film. I, I, I can't remember. Um, and again, I've got no one helping me at this particular moment in time. Now, when we come back on air, um, we will continue, or we will do a, some form of a speed round, I hope, to see if we can get some callers through and some winners. Um, you've got answers down here that are worth a thousand pounds. In fact, let me just let me just find something out. Um, can I speak to my producer? You, 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 this is all very rough and live TV now, but stay with me. How long can I feel for live across the UK? Uh, okay, the last time, the last time I had to do this, by the way, just to let you know, the last time I had to feel, um, I had to feel for 40 minutes. So we're in for a long journey, people, a very long journey. But it's all right, because I'm going to talk about my family in a minute. Okay, so that's worth hanging around for. Uh, can I just ask you, producer of the show, uh, I know I don't know any of the answers, but where are... Um, the films that don't have the big um, stars in them. Which ones are they? This one here. This one here and also this one. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, so that one doesn't have a big star in it. So you've got to think a bit outside the box. And this one doesn't have a big star in it either. All right, okay, so uh, all the others, so that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one, they, oh, hello, they do all have big stars in. Um, now, I've got to say, I've got to say, I've got to say to somebody, if, you, if it's all right with you, um, we do have a technical fault, that's why there's no number on screen at the moment, that's why we're not taking any calls, and this is why I'm under this immense pressure, just to kind of ke keep talking to you, until uh, all, my, all, all my kind of, uh, they're kind of like hobbits. Seriously, they are. Do, do, did you ever watch, okay, did you ever watch um, First Contact, um, which was a, a Star Trek Next Generations movie, yeah? Uh, now, you remember the, uh, they, they're called the Borg, aren't they? They all kind of just sit there like that in their cube ship, waiting to uh, be called to duty. We do have a whole load of people here that work on the show that literally stand up against the wall like this, all right? And they are size of hobbits. They are, they are literally little people. They're little people, and when we get a technical fault, we press the button and they go, we can fix it, we can fix it. Where is the problem? Where is the problem? Let's fix it. Let's fix it. Seriously, it is like that. So there's about, there's literally about seven of them right now. Are, are there seven? Oh, it's a bigger problem than that. Okay, eight of them. Eight of them have now been uh, uh, kind of called to duty and they are trying to fix our problems. So the moment it is sorted, I promise I will open the phone lines. I promise I will give you the chance of getting through to the studio. It's all very exciting. I will explain the game, though, because that's one of my, that's one of my backups. I remember, actually, come here, come here. 
Um, I remember years and years and years ago, um, when I was trying to get into TV, um, I went for an audition. I went for an audition. It was actually for Children's BBC. And uh, I got down to the final six. And in this interview, um, I can't remember the guy's name who, uh, who interviewed me, he said, OK, Chris, let me ask you a question. Because these are the kind of questions I ask you. He said, if we had a little bit of a problem and you were in the broom cupboard and uh, we couldn't show the next programme, what would you do? And I was just sat there going, Mm. I don't really know. He said, well, we would give you six letters. We'd give you six letters from viewers and you could read them out. And I went, that's a brilliant idea. Uh, and just, uh, the reason I'm telling that is because this, I like those letters, okay? If I have a technical problem, I just go, ah, oh, uh, I can just talk about the competition a little bit more. Uh, so that's what I'll do just for a second because in, because in just a moment, I'm gonna talk about something, something else, okay? I haven't quite thought of it yet, everyone. Hello, come in, excuse me. I haven't yet thought about what I'm going to think about uh, or talk about, but I am, I am going to think of something. Oh, I know what I'm going to talk about next. Okay, uh, but for those people that are waiting, all right, I'm wondering what's going on. The show, this is, this is Quiz Call. My name is Chris Hopkins. Hello. Uh, we have a technical fault uh, and the show is live. Um, and because of this technical fault, I now need to just fill time uh, without a, an autocue, a script or anything, which I just, between me and you, I love it. I do, I love technical faults. I just love them. Because it's where I turn from hero, or turn from host, to hero, isn't it? It's like that, isn't it? Uh, seriously, one moment I'm going, dial the number, do this, do that, do the other. Then there's a technical fault. I've got all my eight hobbits going, we will fix it, we will fix it. Trying to sort the problem out. And then suddenly, when this problem is being sorted, I come out and save the day and just talk. And I just, I do genuinely love that. Uh, okay, but guys, this here, this is tonight's competition. When the phone lines are open again, I will tell you about it and what you need to do and how to get through. But basically, we're looking for films with numbers in the title, like Seven, like 101, 101 Dalmatians, Seven Brides for Seven Brothers, and also The Sixth Sense here. Um, this answer here doesn't have a big star in it. Uh, this answer here doesn't have a big star in it either, but all of the other answers do. And the, numbers, the number will appear somewhere in the title. It might be at the beginning, it might be at the middle, uh, it could be at the end, or it could be hidden as part of a word. Somebody came through and said phone booth, okay, which is not actually on the competition, but if you were to write out, oh, let's, let, 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 let's just do that, in fact. Let me just grab, let me just grab this. Uh, I'm going I'm to show you something. This is very, very clever. Um, if I, if, let's put phone booth, okay, this is not a correct answer by the way, but if I just write the word phone, find the number. Ah, oh, look, ah, oh. oh. so one was hidden as part of the word. Are you thinking that's clever? Yeah, 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 we all went to university, we all thought about this kind of stuff, that's very clever isn't it? Uh, so that's one, of the, that's one of the things that you can do and also to remember <laughs> that as well. Okay, so how long have I been filling for? Okay, this isn't bad actually, uh, we, we first had our technical problem, we first had our technical problem at, um, what? Six minutes to one, uh, so I've been, I've been filling time for seven minutes, seven minutes. I've got to tell you actually this, no word of a lie. Um, when this, this form of TV first came to the UK many, 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 many years ago, um, I'd never done it before. And uh, in the audition, uh, they said, OK, they went, hello, Chris. I went, hello. Uh, they said, there are two pictures, two pictures of Christina Aguilera. What we would like you to do, there is, there is, there is a couple of differences. You've got to spot the difference. Can you talk about the two pictures, please, for 15 minutes? And I went, what? What? Really? Uh, yeah, for, so for, for 15 minutes when I first started doing this job, uh, that's what I talked about, Christina Aguilera. And now whenever I kind of hear uh, a song of hers on the radio, I kind of go, oh, that reminds me of when I first auditioned to be um, a kind of quiz TV presenter, I suppose. Uh, oh, by the way, I've got to tell you this. Um, I've got to tell you this. Uh, that, oh no, sh should I tell you that now or shall I, or shall I wait? I, I, no, 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 I think I might wait. Oh, I'm getting some information through, everybody. I'm getting some information through. Ladies and gentlemen, I can tell you, I've been filling live TV for how long? 10 minutes, and I don't really think I spoke about the same thing twice. I think we've sorted out the problem. I have become 
the hero of the show. I